We've got some exciting news about the base and mid icon packs in FIFA 21, and I want to share it with you. For cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description, and use the code HABER to get yourself a discount on all of your orders. How is it going, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. This morning, I got out of bed, right, and I was just scrolling Twitter on my phone, and I see something very exciting regarding FIFA 21, and I thought I would share this with you in a video. If you guys don't know who Footwatch is, Footwatch uh, is a member of the community that can check the EA FIFA database um, on his device, and he can see when new things get added to the database. For example, today, added to the database was a base icon pack and a mid icon pack. So guarantees a base icon uh, player and guarantees a mid icon player. Obviously, we have had this before in previous years. Uh, last year, we got the ba base icon pack on November 22nd. Um, and obviously, the date today is, I think, the 21st of November, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, it's it's Saturday, the 21st of November. So we could get the, ba the base icon pack as soon as today, tomorrow, Monday. Um, mid icon pack also is in there. That could be something for maybe for Black, Black Friday, or it could be released with the base icon pack. You never know. So I went and found uh, the base icon pack from November 22nd last year. Uh, this is when we first got it in FIFA 20. And I thought I'd have a look at the requirements that we had to complete for the base icon last year. So we had an 83, an 86, an 86, and an 80. Seven Raiders squad. So it's actually quite expensive. Um, it, obviously, you get a base icon uh, pack in return for it, but it was, you know, it was a bit pricey. I think at the time it was costing, I want to say, around four to five hundred thousand coins per upgrade. I know because I was doing an absolute ton of them. Um, but yeah, last year it was costing quite a lot. Um, and I think this year will be no different. In fact, this year, I think it might even be more expensive. I think it's easier to get coins this year than it was last year. And EA know that. We know that. So EA might bump up the requirements a little bit. In terms of the mid-icon pack, I'll be honest with you. Um, I'm not entirely sure why it's in this code. Um, I'm not sure why EA have added it now. It could be for icon swaps at the start of December. Because that's only a week or two away uh, when we get our first icon swaps. So EA might release the mid-icon pack in icon swaps. And to be honest, they might even release the base icon pack in icon swaps. We could be getting excited for nothing. But it is not just the base mid icon pack that EA have put into the code. And this is also why I'm incredibly excited. EA have released a ton of new upgrade packs in there as well. So we already had the Team of the Week player, but they've released a 281 plus rated rare player pack. We obviously know that as a 281 plus double upgrade. Um, you know, we already know about that. There's something we've had before. Um, nothing, nothing out of the ordinary, nothing new. Um, but that will, you know, release into the game pretty shortly. Um, we have got the uh, guarantees three rare gold players rated 81 or higher. So we have the 381 plus upgrade, something we haven't seen yet in FIFA, I don't think. If I'm wrong, Wrong, please correct me, but I'm pretty sure we've not seen a 381 plus rated player pack. We've seen it a 380 plus uh, player pick, but not a player pack. Um, so that guarantees you three players that are all at 81 plus. And given how OP the 81 pluses were last year, having three of them in one pack could be ridiculous. Like we could be seeing some insane packs um, in the 381 plus upgrade. Um, we also have the 283 plus rare, rare player upgrade, which guarantees you um, two rare gold players, 83 or higher. Again, these are in the in the code. They've been added in this morning, and these could be for something as, as simple as Black Friday in a week's time. You know, I think that on Friday we get the Black Friday promo, uh, and we could get the best off team of the week in there as well. And this is, could be uh, what EA are putting into the SBT section for that. They could be putting in upgrades all weekend for us to grind out, which I am not opposed to. I would love some upgrades to grind on Black Friday. Or, for some reason, EA could be putting in the base icon pack tonight or tomorrow into the game, and these could be put in coincided to kind of help with the grindability of that pack. And, you know, I wouldn't put it past the A to kind of release coinciding player upgrades for icon upgrades. So, for example, the base icon pack comes out, they release the 280 plus or 381 plus upgrade because that obviously helps a lot of players grind towards the base and the, and the mid icon packs when they've came out. Um, you know, in previous years, uh, when if we look at, for example, um, the SBCs that are out right now, I'm sure we have uh, some version of, uh, of, of decent... Yeah, we have Marky Matt, up, so we probably have some more SBCs uh, on the other section. Can I find where Nep goes to the start? Let me see what we have. Uh, play them with Thiago Silva. Wow, it's weird seeing him at PSG now. He's been at Chelsea for so long. 
I guess I guess we didn't get any upgrades actually last year with uh, with the icon with the base icon. So um, that makes me even more inclined to believe that the eighty one plus and the double eighty one triple eighty one plus the eighty three plus is that makes me more inclined to believe that they will be releasing um, on Black Friday. Now another thing I will quickly mention: the two eighty three plus rated rare players pack is very very likely that it will be a one off SBC. If you guys remember during I think team of the season last year, we actually got SBCs like that. You know, an eighty four plus a 284 plus and things like that and ea didn't release them repeatable they were in for one one off only sbcs and usually they were very very poor value as well and i think ea will do the same i think that the uh, repeatable ones will be the two or the 381 rated rare plus upgrade i think that, that they will be the repeatable uh, upgrade sbcs that we get uh in the game uh and i'm, I'm assuming so anyway I, i'm guessing that will be what we get in terms of uh the repeatable sbcs so uh, i'm guessing we'll get those probably on friday um, and then sometime in midweek, we might get the 283 pluses if we get the, the base icon pack either this weekend or in the next couple of days. But I just wanted to bring you guys a video kind of talking to you guys about what's going on in FIFA at the minute. Because I know there'll be a bunch of you guys that don't follow Footwatch or don't know who Footwatch is or don't know that this is actually a thing. Um, but whenever we get new content, Footwatch usually tweets out the code for it first. So we know what we're getting. For example, the base icon pack, mid icon pack and everything else that we've had so far. Uh, Footwatch is on top of it all. It usually um, tweets out and kind of brings out uh you know pictures showing you guys what's in the code um so if you are on twitter you are active on twitter i'd highly recommend following him um, and if you're not then i'll bring you guys more videos if you guys want uh when we you know get information like this in the morning because you know if i'm if i'm awake at, at 7 a.m and, and we get information like this i am down to upload it i really am um but thank you all for watching this video make sure to leave a like if you guys did enjoy and comment down below if you guys are excited for the uh base or the mid icon pack one thing i will say don't get your hopes up for it to be in the next couple of days if you guys remember the 589 plus situation from last year uh we never even got that you know so this could be next week some of this could be in uh icon swaps it literally like it, it doesn't guarantee it's coming in the next couple of days it just means it's coming so it could be tomorrow it could be on friday it could be a week on friday it could be for icon swaps we don't guarantee know when it will come we just know that it's on its way. Uh, so don't, you know, get your hopes up too high uh, in preparation for it because I don't I don't know if it'll be today or tomorrow. In terms of investing, I don't trade, so I don't really know about investing, but I don't think it will harm you picking up some 83s, 84s, 85s, 86s, especially some of the higher 80, you know, 86, 87s. I don't think it will harm you. I don't think you'll lose many coins um, if you are going to do that. I, I think what I'll do is I'll probably pick up a bit of fodder over the next week or two, depending on when we get the, the packs, basically, and we sort of see what happens with that. But thank you all for watching the video thank you all for the support on the channel really appreciate it guys and i'll see you lads later